Check it out guys. Ho ho ho. It's been sitting for about almost a month now. Haven't been start her up. We got something special with this car. Look at those leaves. Yeah, I'll show you guys what came in in the mail. Let's go. Alright guys, check it out. We got the STI 2.5 engine. We got a lot of stuff came in in the mail, but first we're gonna show you how that thing installed is HKS. There's a factory one. We're gonna exchange that, but first we're gonna listen to this factory sound, how it looked like before we install the new one in. All right, Jasmine. Okay, so Jasmine here, we're gonna start the engine and then just like kinda just hold the throttle down, okay? Hold on, I'll let you know. We're gonna start the engine first. Okay, and then just hold Oops. Wow, so loud. Okay, just slowly tap the gas. What if I did too much? Not too much, just a slow, slowly one. Try. See? <laughs> Again? Like what number? Number four. 4,000 RPM. <laughs> okay, again. One more. Okay, that's good. Thanks, Jassy. You can get out now. Thanks for doing that. Yeah. No, the window's down there. I roll it down. All right, guys, so you can see, you can see that uh, stock sound of the engine, cob, hatback exhaust on that thing. All right, so let's go under the hood and uh, change that blow off valve. All right, guys, so I, I opened this up already just to make sure that uh, it's the, the right one that I ordered. Um, there's come over the, the hose, the hardware kit, the plug-in, and then this is that blow-up valve, that HKS right there. This is the money shot right there. So we're gonna replace this. We're gonna put this on here and we'll take that one out. All right guys, so first thing we'll uh, take out this uh, vacuum line and there's a zip tie right here. Alright, so there's two bolts, uh, 12 mil sockets on those. Twelve mil. And then there's a hose right here. So there's a clamp right there. I'm gonna use a eight mil ratchet on that clamp hose. I got that clamp loose. I'm gonna just use a pick right here to pull out this hose out. Just pull it out just like that. All right, guys. So I'm uh, gonna open up the manual. <laughs> Regards about this fitting right here. So this round block right here it goes into the to the hose. So we'll plug the hose. So all we need is this, and then that, and then a couple hoses, and then the zip tie, and this one-way valve. All right, so let's uh, plug the hole here. We're gonna tighten the clamp so that this thing is not gonna go anywhere. Okay. All right, guys, so that's a nice and snug. This cap right here is not gonna go anywhere. Just gonna have to tuck that in inside like that. You don't want any leak of air coming out or going in there so just gonna tuck it in so that nobody will see it now we're gonna install this blow valve HKS 
the thing about this is uh the original gasket is missing supposed to get a new one so i forgot so gonna have to uh bolt it in flush to the air cooler for now and then uh, we'll put a gasket when i get one all right so uh for some people they need to clock this in so it will fit right on the inner cooler uh, but to me it looks like I do need to clock it in because it's not the bolt is not gonna go in all right so just need to uh, turn this over like that put the bolt in and then turn it back where it was from before just like that okay you don't need to uh, take out that retainer spring inside this part right here and then it's gonna snug it up on this side nice and snug same thing here nice and snug there you go nice and snug guys that's it all right, so we could uh, move this straight forward like that. So that looks straight, it looks better. All right, so I put this uh, hose right here, this vacuum line from the kit. I top it into this T connector. This hose down here is going to the intake manifold. This hose right here is to my uh, boost gauge. There's a one-way valve. And this one right here, gonna go to our uh, blow off valve. All right, I've been saying one way valve, I guess this is a, a filter. It's, a, it's only a filter, it's not a big deal which way this thing goes, it's just a filter. All right, guys, I got the hose in here. I'm gonna cut the link here, right over here. So I cut it here so we could put this uh, filter in goes in like this and then the other side goes in like that very easy there all right so you can see that's my setup right there maybe I could go shorter than this maybe it's better but let's just give this a try all right let's go start the engine That looks sick. My God. <laughs> Sounds good. Sounds legit. It's the real deal. All right, bring you into the cab. All right, here we go, guys. Man, this is sounds awesome. Sounds sick. Here we go. Watch the boost gauge. Love it. Damn. S sounds awesome. Wow. Man, love that thing. Good invest. Good investment. Make sure you get the real one. Don't get those cheap one. All right. There we go. Quick install blow valve HKF on the brew TI. That's it guys. Thanks for watching. Next video, we got lots of parts here. Lots of parts. Gates. Right there. Tons of parts. That's it. So stay tuned for the next one. Subscribe, like the video, thumbs up. Get you more content coming in. Thanks for watching. See you again.